31st of October, 1898. Hello, and welcome back to Fox Face. Today is a special treat, a game I have not before played, called Kudelka. This is the precursor to Shadow Hearts 1. The story of Sarasab, if you would. And for Elden Thrones, this is Torrent over here. This is where you originate to. It is a late game. Late stage PS1 game actually. This is for Switch PS2. Too early, Angel. I'm not dead yet. This is PS1 era voice acting. Enjoy. Not yet, but it looks like you're going to die soon. Maybe. But you'll have to pardon me while I tend to some unfinished business first. Business? What can you possibly accomplish in your condition? You can't even hold your gun steady. Well, no one less a try. That thing's not gonna die unless I shoot it two or three times. Oh, cool. Oh, PS One gave me a little bit of analog stick.
Hey, what about him? He's dead. Really? Thank you. So I guess my time is up. Hey, Angel. I'm not gonna ask you to take me to heaven. But will you pray for me at least? Are you out of your mind? There's no bloody way I'm going to pray for you. But I guess I owe you because you saved me too. She is an atheist. In case you're wondering. Payback time. Okay, let's go. Stand up or I'll leave you here. What happened? It doesn't, doesn't hurt anymore. I'm cured. Yeah, and so I cured you, so what? You? You cured me. Squall. But, but I was almost dead. Yeah, and? I'm confused, so you really are an angel? Don't be foolish. <laughs> Do you really think that there are angels on Earth? I'm no angel. I'm just a medium with a little curing. I'm I'm Edward J. Plunkett. I, I know I look pretty shady, but you don't look too wholesome yourself. I... No, I'm not like you. And this is no place for people like you. Why did you come here? I heard a rumor. A rumor? I heard something in London. That the son of some rich family bought an old monastery. Spent a ton of money to convert it into a house. I heard he brought quite a lot of harlots here. Seems like he was having a great time. So, where is this monastery? That's what I want to know. I came all this way to put a poor man's fear of God into this rich bastard. So far, I haven't found anything. Then this monster attacked me. I, I almost got killed. If you'd come any later, no doubt I'd be singing hymns in his stomach right I now. I shouldn't have bought such a good horse. She's too fast. Too bad you won't be hearing me sing those hymns. When I was a boy, I was a pretty good soprano. If you don't stop talking, I'll leave you here. My name is Kudalka, and I'm only going to say this once, so don't forget. If you want to get out of here alive, I suggest you stick very close. Got it? Harlot means whore. Charmed, I'm sure. Okay, so load time between screen trace systems is exceptionally long. I don't even open the menu here. Circle button. Okay. Hello, cards. Cool. Okay, it's drawing heavily on chest parallels here. Very interesting. Oh, that. Let's play the game now.
magic. Oh, flare? Okay. So far, for a late game PS1 game, I'm actually enjoying it. Hmm. So, I wonder why I went back it up. Is there an inventory issue here? Maybe. Let's see. Staircases I have to go up, or I'm gonna go up that way. Do I have to pull the game? Part of my greatness here, that's a very nervous game. a knight, correct? So we can attack in L formation. Oh crap. She's dead. She's how do I I don't even feel like she's dead. Does she sound like that? Ah, 
she's dead, so I can't that push on her. Um, okay. Um, wait. No. Sorry, just action attack first, right? No. So I can move up to here. Oh, no, again. Back way in terror. Okay, got it. There's an escape button. Interesting. We are experiencing audio difficulties. So I'm being walked through by a tech-savvy friend of mine. So far, I'm very confused in the whole battle system of this game. It's very counterintuitive. I want to say it's very chesty, but at the same time, it's... The flow of battle is very interesting. Alright, so is this better? Hopefully. Oh, 
Okay, I'm going to use a high potion on Kudelka. Get it back to full, and I am out of everything, I believe. Very confused in terms of battle, and here we go again. Is there anything here I can take? Any sort of keys or anything of the sort? Nothing useful at all. Like, really, just check again one more time. Come on, really. I may or may not have wasted my potions. That remains to be seen. Hmm. Okay. Let's do it again. Oh, I had to go through that door right there. Oh, nice. Oh, I have to press X at the stairs. Oh, okay. Oh. Okay. So, all right. It's a Resident Evil style game with the pistol rounds. I know it's lazy to categorize these games into Final Fantasy and Resident Evil, but this is what I get vibes of, because I play a couple different games. They're getting shot. Do I have to load the pistol rounds in there? Roach. What the hell? Bang. Oh, they got me. Nice. Okay. So I was just taking there. Yeah, back to what I was saying earlier, the flow of battle is very unique. Because it can't quite grasp it. But I think it has more to do with the uh, lack of not experience out of this game. This is actually a blind first playthrough, so... And plus the game's over 20 years old. 22 now. Years old. Oh, cool. Give me that strength. Alright. Ooh, whiskey. Yeah, so... I might try and look around a bit. Oh, you need to press X on every set of stairs. That's inconvenient. It's a fixed camera angle, but the screen digits are a bit longer, so it lends itself to this right here problem. Where, yeah, I try to pick one thing up. Bread. Nice. Alright. Thank you. I don't know why he keeps on asking if I want to pick something up. Is it limited inventory or not? Is bread a tool? Can I use a network? Nice. He has used the bread tool. We have the roach and queen roach. Oh, crap. What's it up? Ah. Oh. That's just all kinds of nasty. It's not a spider, it's a tick, I want to say. Ah, uh, I'm gonna shoot it just in case. There you go, sit down. Good. I'll be here, maybe. Let's go! One shot, one kill, whatever. Okay, so my main point of contention here was that I didn't know we need pistol rounds to operate the gun. Mr. Blunkett, let's go!
to beds. Can I rest here? Is that the beds are here? I mean, it's not ideal, it's the most important. More roaches? Wow. Stab it. Bang. Oh, not a kill? Darn it. Oh, wait, because I want to stay down. What? Stay away. I said, wait, damn it. Okay, now I've stabbed it. Okay, I'm getting more into the combat in this game. It's a lot different than anything I played before, actually, in terms of combat. This bad for me? No. Yeah, so it's fixed camera angles with um, odd transitions. And requires you to press X to ascend and descend. Which again is very Resident Evil style too. Alright. Store lock. Oh. Hello again. So, what I find about this game that's different from the other games I've played in the series is when you get into a battle, instead of having that breaking glass sound or random swishy noise sound, it's just a calm, not in any way unsettling random counter. It's just, oh, here you are, and then battle. And the battle music is also relaxing. This is a good game to stream just casually and a little night maybe. It's not very sound intensive or loud, just, it's not trying to learn about anything, it just is what it is. And I get why this became the what became what it was at least because it introduced a lot of themes I found throughout the whole entire series, the horror style, the gothicness, and they do they expand upon it in Shadow Hearts One, but kind of do away with it in King and Shadow Hearts Two in favor of a more funny, humorous. Kind of balancing between scary and then comical. I personally like Shadow Hearts 2, probably my favorite game in the whole entire series. But I can't deny this game has no merit in terms of uh, sound composition. And that has all kinds of nasty. Welcome to Britain. Get it, Britain. References. If you know, you know. Oh, watch your proper. I'm going to wait and save Alan. Uh, second thought, I'm just going to squat shoot him. Oh, no, can't do that. Alright, fine, I'll wait. It's getting ready or something. I don't like that. Oh! Is this Vaughn blood in me? I swear to Christ, you better stab at something. I don't know. Stab it. Kill it. It won't die. Why won't it die? Ah, uh, yeah, bye. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave too. See ya. Yeah. 
don't don't tell me how the rounds are ready. I gave you 20 pistol bolts. You didn't lose all of them, did you? Yeah, I'm fine with that. Sledging damage. I can live with that. But you can heal. Um, actually, no. Yeah, I'm gonna have you heal her then. Since you're not doing anything, really. Close. Stab. Boom, shit down. What? This thing is very resilient to attacks, actually. I'm not okay with that. Can, can you just seriously not shoot? I'm just gonna go bare hand and go in there and just, just, just do it. I'm gonna punch it. I don't give a shit. <laughs> 